So as I said, these are very new programs. In fact, two of them haven't been launched yet. So this would be the perfect time for you to explore them further and take Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So Canada has announced three new immigration programs this month itself, that is in the month of March 2021. And a lot of people still don't know about these programs. And all these three programs are pilot programs, which means that they are open only for a limited period of time. So without wasting any more time, my name is Nishant and if you are interested in watching some valuable content about Canada immigration, life in Canada, job search in Canada and a lot more, then please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you get the notifications for all our future videos. And now let's get started. So as I said, there are three programs. One has just launched on 24th of March. The second one will open on 31st of March and the last one will open on 22nd of April 2021. All these three programs are for the province of Quebec and all these three programs will be catering to different types of professions. And unlike other pilot programs, which are usually open for two years or so, this, I mean, these three particular programs will close on 1st of January 2026. That is, they are open for approximately five years. So even if you are planning to come to Canada on a study permit, this could be a great option for you and you should definitely consider Quebec as well. So the first one is a pilot program for the workers within the food processing industry. This program has been launched on 24th of March and through this program, the province of Quebec is planning to select 550 workers within the food processing industry per year along with their family members. And now let's look at the knock codes, I mean the professions that the province of Quebec is targeting under this program. So number one, industrial butcher and meat cutter and related workers. Number two, laborer in food and beverage processing. And then laborer in fish and seafood, specialized cleaner, process control and machine operator, general farm worker and fish and seafood plant worker. I will discuss the eligibility in brief at the end because the criteria for all these three programs are very similar and the rest I will leave the links for all these three programs in the description box so you can check for the further details and also if you want to get in touch with an authorized regulated immigration consultant then there is a link for that as well in the description box because in the last two months I have received over 100 messages where people are asking about the immigration consultant who helped us in our process. So there is a link below, just click on that, fill out your basic contact details and your query in brief and they will get in touch with you themselves within 5 to 7 business days. Now coming back to the topic, the second pilot program which will come into effect on 31st of March 2021 is for the orderlies. Orderlies are basically the healthcare professionals such as hospital attendants and nurses. Through this program, the province is again planning to select 550 orderlies per year along with their family members. And now let's look at the knock codes that the province is targeting under this program. The first one is nursing coordinator and supervisor. The second is registered nurse and registered psychiatric nurse. And then we have allied primary health practitioners, then licensed practical nurse and home support workers, housekeepers and related occupations. And now the third pilot program which will come into effect on 22nd of April 2021 is for the people in artificial intelligence, IT and visual effects sector. So basically there are two streams within this program. One is for the people in artificial intelligence and second one is for the people in IT and visual effects sector. And through this program as well, the province of Quebec is planning to select 550 people per year along with their family members, which means 275 people for artificial intelligence and 275 people for IT and visual effects sector. For AI, it does not specify any particular knock code. It simply says that you should be in the AI sector. But for the IT and visual effects sector, the knock codes that are targeted are as follows. Information systems analyst and consultant. Graphic designer and illustrator, but only if your job is in the visual effects sector. Computer and Information Systems Manager, Software Engineer and Designer, Electrical and Electronics Engineer and the rest you can see on your screen. So if you want, you can pause the video for a while. Now talking about the selection criteria for all these three programs, so you guessed it right. If it is for the province of Quebec, then yes, you would need proficiency in spoken French. But hold on, there is a good news for the people in AI, IT and visual effects because for that particular pilot program, French is not a mandatory requirement. So if you know French, then you can apply under the francophone profile, which means that you know how to speak French. But if you don't know how to speak French, I mean, if you are not proficient in uh, spoken French, then you can apply under the francization profile. 
I don't know if it's called francization or francization, but it basically means that if you apply under the francization profile, then you will automatically be registered for the integration services for immigrants in Quebec so that they can support your learning of French and your integration into the Quebec culture and their society. And why? Because they need you because uh, IT and AI sector is booming in the province of Quebec. And apart from French, some other common criteria are that you should be 18 years of age or above. You should have an intent to stay in Quebec. You should have at least a diploma in the relevant field. You should have some work experience in one of the given NOC codes. And you should have a job offer from the province of Quebec in one of the given NOC codes. But if you are applying for the pilot program, which is for the workers within the AI sector specifically, then you don't necessarily need work experience. Even if you are a Quebec graduate with a job offer in the relevant field, you can still apply. So the point is that these programs are not only suitable for the people who are already in Quebec and working in those relevant fields, but also for the people who are in Quebec as an international student studying one of the programs in these relevant fields or for someone who is planning to come to Canada on a study permit either just after their 12th or bachelor's or just because they are not getting enough CRS score in the express entry. So for all of you, these programs could be a ray of hope and you should definitely consider the province of Quebec for your study programs in these relevant fields. Because once you complete your study programs, you get a postgraduate work permit which will allow you to work in Quebec in these relevant professions. And once you have some work experience, you can apply for PR under these pilot programs. Programs. And as I said, these pilot programs will close on 1st January 2026. So you have enough time to come as a student, complete your studies, gain some work experience and then apply for PR. So as I said, these are very new programs. In fact, two of them haven't been launched yet. So this would be the perfect time for you to explore them further and take the necessary actions as soon as possible. So I have provided the link for all these three programs in the description box. So please check it out and read the details line by line. And as I said in the beginning, if you need assistance of an authorized immigration consultant to process your file, then the link for that is in the description box as well. And now it's time for me to go. So thank you for watching guys and I'll see you in our next video. Till then, you know what you need to do. You need to take care of yourself. You need to stay safe and you need to keep watching our videos. Bye bye.